Hey, I hope you're awesome. My name is Sydney Dao. Thank you so much for joining us today. Before I start this vlog, I just want to send out a big thank you to each and every one of you who's been watching, liking, and commenting on the vlogs. They've been performing much better than I expected, and I'm very much taken aback by your support and your incredible interaction with the content that I create. So today we are back in the Western Cape. It's been three months in the Northeast in Gauteng. We've been with family, and now we're going back to Cape Town. And on our way back to Cape Town, we decided to take a detour and visit at this beautiful place it's truly truly magical so shortly i'm going to give you guys a tour of the villa that we are staying at this place is 11 hours outside of johannesburg and it is in between naisna and george in the western cape province so without further ado join us let's check it out Nestled in the mountains of Uniondale in the Western Cape, I'm very much pleased and honored to have partnered with Sunet and her husband in introducing to you the Beloofde land. It's a farm that is located parallel to the Williamsburg Mountain Reserve in Uniondale. It lies between Neisner and George. It is a farm that is accessible through a gravel road just off the N9. It's a winding road that drives for at least 20 minutes. At the end of the road, you will dig the valley with an onlooking view of this magical farm. It's owned by a couple, the charismatic and fantastic Sunette and her husband. They were incredibly hospitable and they run this working farm. On the farm, there's a variety of live animals, including springbok, there's chickens, there's goose, and there's two cute donkeys called apple and peach that are also found on the farm. It is a running farm, but it also offers three accommodation options of which I will take you guys through the one we stayed at, which will be the first and the two other options, which are also accessible on the farm as part of the accommodation. The eponymous Dikirbo 
It sits right on the edge on the cliff overlooking the Kiobrum River. It offers a king bed sort of set up a duplex style home. On the inside you walk into a beautiful receiving area with a comfortable seat that offers natural lighting and a coat hanger. As you proceed is a fully styled kitchen with all the functionality that you are used to. The house itself offers a country style setup with high double volume ceilings, beautiful rustic and vintage furniture on the inside with pale white painted walls and beautiful shiny finishes of brass and gold just to bring in the entire interior of the house on the inside. As you proceed through, you are welcomed by a beautiful mirror which offers you a set of books to keep you entertained as you switch off from the greater world. It offers a nice setup area where you can keep some of your belongings at close reach. To your left, there is a guest toilet which you can use with easy access from the lounge and the kitchen. And then towards your right is the master bedroom which offers you a king bed, beautiful white rollout throughout the entire house. There are nice touches of vintage furniture in the room and a beautiful soft plush faux cowskin rug. To the left, you are welcomed by the master bedroom bathroom, which is incredibly, incredibly designed with industrial finishes and some touches of modernity. There are two shower heads and one of the showers is a rain shower, which overlooks the beautiful valley where the Kierbaum River cracks through. On the outside, as you open up the double doors that give you 180 degree views of the valley, you enter onto beautiful sweeping views of the valleys and the river. You can clearly hear the hissing sounds of the river from the bottom. There's a very generous veranda where you can entertain. There are board games, there's a comfortable couch and also provided are some throws for those winter nights. The beautiful big windows in the room offers you beautiful lighting, which is reflected against the white and just makes an explosive visual of the room where you are with very soft white tones and a comfortable sitting couch on the side if you'd like to end your day by reading your favorite novel or maybe listening to music or reading a bible. In the winter nights you have the convenience of a fireplace inside the unit you just throw some firewood there, you sit back on the comfortable plush couches with some additional blanketing in case it becomes too cold, which just creates a beautiful ambience and a warmth that you would require to enjoy a glass of wine or a wonderful dinner on the big dining table that is situated at the center between the kitchen and the lounge. The sitting room also has double doors which open up onto the same veranda which is parallel to the exit doors of the main bedroom. It also sweeps you out onto the sprawling views of the upper Langclou Valley with beautiful relaxing sounds of the Kierb Warm River just running down below. Onto the distance towards your right are springbok and other wild animals just hopping away into the beautiful greenery that sweeps into all the farm and just gives you this immaculate, immaculate views. And you just enjoy the peace and quiet of being in nature surrounded by fresh air. The downstairs unit comprises a queen room with its own separate access near the private pool offered by the entire unit. As you walk in, you enter the small kitchenette, which is very functional with all the required appliances. And there's this big, beautiful couch in the middle of the room which you can rest on and just take in all the immaculate views from that viewpoint as you proceed on through is the queen room with a queen bed and some beautiful animal deco as you proceed to the smaller door is another shower and bath the shower also offers beautiful views of the side of the valley and some beautiful hot running water
The second unit, which is also on the main farm, is the Fissermen, which offers a contemporary farm style accommodation with an open plan setup as you walk in from the veranda side. There are comfortable sitting chairs outside and a brine point, a comfortable queen bed, which is also surrounded by a beautiful deco of a farm style house. And as you proceed through the room, you towards the back, you will access the small kitchen area with dedicated appliances that offers everything you would need. This is only accommodating for two people or a single person who's just looking for an individual escape into the farm. Last but most definitely not least is the Sorvanger, which is the deluxe accommodation located at the top of the mountain outside of the main farmland and it's secluded up with sweeping views off the mountains, beautiful manicured gardens. It also offers a private pool and also an individual windmill which can be viewed from the second bedroom at the top. As you drive up, you have views of the windmill and the entrance of the accommodation. Inside, there's a beautiful wooden staircase that you use to ascend to the bedroom upstairs, which has also sweeping views of the windmill. Downstairs is another second bedroom. This unit can accommodate four individuals. The kitchen offers a beautiful bar style setup with ultra modern appliances and finishes and a beautiful, beautiful furniture that has burst amounts of flavor with some Spanish motivation, a gorgeous astro turf to relax and sunbathe in the summer days and a beautiful private plunge pool to take in all the beauty of the mountains that surround you. Outside is an external shower, which is also heated for those that are a bit adventurous in nature. The shower also has running hot water. There's also a secluded table near a rock where you can sit in and just take in the morning and have your morning coffee in the beautiful views of the Sorvanga. Balcony on the Sorvanga is a round balcony, so you can walk around the unit with sweeping views of the entire farm. In the distance, you will see beautiful wildlife you would see three dams that can be used for fishing and overall it offers an immaculate immaculate architecture experience and interior deco A big thank you to Sunet and Barry who helped us capture some of the footage for the video. So Barry, this is to you. Thank you so much for contributing to the success of this. And Sunet, your wonderful hospitality presents itself forth before you even speak. We had such an amazing experience and I would totally recommend to anyone who wants to exit the busy bustling world of corporate, of health sciences, of social sciences, of anything that is keeping you busy and is earning you an income, this is a type of place you go to to unwind, to detach, to disconnect completely. There is no cell service on the property. This will allow you to engage with whomever you took there with you and if you are alone, you have a plethora of options in terms of the books that you can read that will keep you busy, but it will allow you to refresh, to regenerate, so that when you get back to the hustle, you are well refreshed and you are well renewed to take on whatever challenges that are there. So I will totally recommend to anyone who would like to go to the property to visit that you book this place in order to just enjoy being one with nature. A big shout out to you for watching. Thank you so much for your continued support. I really appreciate it and it inspires and motivates me to keep making these videos so i'll end this video right here and i'll see you guys in the next video all right ciao